Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to connect multiple Z lights through the i200 controller. It is very easy and it only takes a few minutes. First, you only need one controller per 99 lights and each light has to be attached with the i200R receiver. For this video, I will be demonstrating how to connect three Z lights. If you have any questions regarding about these lights, there is a quick unboxing and setup video in the description box below. The specs will also be in the description box as well. First, start off by having the controller and all the lights unplugged and not connected to any power source. Then, power on the i200 controller. For the first light you want to connect, press G for group number on the controller, select 1 and hit save. The screen will ask you to turn on the light. Once you turn on the light, the Z light should flash a few times. Press auto on the controller and this completes the first light. Now on to the second light, hit G on the controller for group number, press the plus symbol for number two, hit save, turn on the Z light, It should flash a few times, press auto, then it is connected. For the third light, hit G on the controller, plus symbol for number three, hit save, turn on the light, it should flash a few times, press auto, and that completes the third light. Now if you want to go back to the first light to adjust the light settings, press G, the minus symbol, to go back to 1, hit save, and press auto. If you press dawn, you can adjust the time when you want the dawn setting to start then cycle through the sunrise you can do the same with daytime sunset and nighttime and then hit save once when you're done and if you want to adjust the color go to the second row of the remote and press Dawn and you can adjust the white, blue, red, and the purple is only available on the Z-Lite ZS7000. Once when you finish adjusting the color, you can hit save. And if you want to go do the same thing for the second light, go back to G. Number two, hit save, and press auto, and you can control it. If you somehow made a mistake on adjusting the time or any of the light settings, just press and hold the reset button on the remote. In about five seconds, it should give a reset OK on the display, and that resets the light. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below, and see you all very soon.